this is a 60 note triplet lick and uh, what is really great with these kind of licks is that you got a built-in backbeat and uh, we also play four on the floor meaning we're playing quad notes on the kick drum so we got that flow going that will fit in so many songs so uh, you can play this feel without ruining the song you will actually you know lift many songs uh, when playing this feel give it more energy and the trick here is to really play the accents with the shoulder of the stick this part not the tip and we're going to play all the unaccented notes on the hi-hat with the tip so let me play it if I played it very undynamical undynamically let me show how that will sound just on the hi-hat just play some stuff To me that sounds stiff and boring. You no know, dynamics in drumming is close to everything. So uh, compare that version that I played with this one when I play the accents, when I play accents with the shoulder of the sticks. Now we are starting to say something. You know, we don't talk like this in the same dynamic range. So we don't want to play like that, of course. Uh, you know, start by figuring out the sticking, of course, taking it very slow, really accenting the accents with the shoulder of your sticks. And then when you can do it on the hi-hat, try to move the backbeat down and play it as well. Uh, you can also move this sticking around the drums, uh, around the toms and snare, for example. I think the most important part here is not actually to learn these licks, but to take the ideas and make them your own. So one thing you can do that is really cool is to build your own grooves like this, groove licks. So then your foundation can be you no know, chord notes on the kick drum and the backbeat. Then you can, you know, take a paper, a pen, and write down a mixture of these stickings that I will give you. The first one is uh, an inverted paradiddle diddle. If you move the second accent with the right hand onto the snare, then you got a backbeat. Uh, the second sticking I will give you is just right, left, left. And the third one I will give you is right, right, left. If you mix those three stickings up, you can come, come up with some really great stuff. Let me just demo, demo this. I will just mix them up randomly.
can also split them up so the left hand will play the hi hat and the right hand will play an X hat that I got here or a right if you have that. Uh, I will demo with the X hat a little bit here. So there you have a couple of ideas. Go nuts with them. See you in the next lesson.